they keep our children safe and educated. We're talking about everyone in our local schools. Yeah, it's a, truly a team effort. Yeah, such a challenging job these folks have, especially, especially during a pandemic. That's so, right. Keeping our children engaged in learning during this time of virtual school or hybrid classes is truly a challenge. So true professionals like Ball High School robotics teacher Kathy Pickavance. Yeah, she coaches the number one robotics team in the entire state. She and her students have built their robots and arenas in the basement of the school with very little supplies. And this year with COVID cutting fundraisings, their resources took an even bigger hit. Even so, Mrs. Pickavance tells her students no amount of money will replace hard work and dedication. Here's KPRC2 Sophia Ojeda. Okay. And they were here until about midnight working. Current state champs Ball High School robotics team is getting ready for Worlds competition next week. It takes hours and hours of hard work and dedication. We wake up and we compete on Saturdays. We leave at about 5 in the morning and then we get back Saturday evening around 8 or 9, sometimes 10 at night. The team holds the highest skill score for the state of Texas. They have competed alongside big universities like LSU and Florida State and score even higher. And they've been able to do it with not a lot of money or resources. We're definitely the underdogs when it comes to what we have. These kids have to work twice as hard, which they don't even mind doing or they will never complain about. They're just happy to have the chance. The competition includes a challenge from tournament organizers and some supplies. The students then have to build a robot that will complete that challenge. We have a tub of metal and uh, screws and bolts and they uh, will they're supposed to measure twice and cut once and they'll measure and cut the metal file it down smooth it down um, and build the robots whenever we were so motivated and wanted to get to worlds win at worlds win win regionals win states she was right there behind us. I'm grateful for all the time that she's put in to make us successful. Her students say Mrs. Pickavance, who also just had a baby, juggles everything so well and makes it look so easy, but she won't take credit. She says the students deserve all the attention. I really say it's all them. They're amazing and I couldn't do it without them. Honoring May heroes, Sophia Ojeda, KPRC 2 News. Oh, incredible and world's competition is set for May 16th through the 22nd in Ball High School gym and if you're interested in sponsoring the team helping them out with supplies or donations you can simply contact Miss Pick Vance at Ball High School in Galveston a big thank you to her yeah the good ones make it look really easy yeah All right, Miss Pick Vance to thank you and for your hard work KPRC2 and Uptown Houston would like to give you a gift certificate for brunch at the Rustic oh, enjoy enjoy and